Hello, welcome to Looky Looky Loo Crafts. I'm Candace, and I'm here today, and I got me a whole bunch of little boxes, y'all. Little boxes. And I got these. Uh, I don't want you to have a great big view of them because uh, nobody wants to see this. But uh, I got these boxes. I want you to see what size it is. Uh, let's see, there we go. And, uh, so my my desk is a mess okay so what I'm thinking is I'll take my butter box here and stand it up maybe on the side I want to keep a lid flap I don't know why but I do uh, through my pencil box. Maybe I'll make it cozy to go over the top of my pencil box. But uh, So I want this box to be a pencil box. Okay? So it'll be standing up like that. And then it'll have this box in front of it. Maybe. Maybe I'll tuck my pencil box on the side. I want it glued on, y'all, so that it don't come over. Come on, get my flaps in like that. Okay. And then I want a little box here in the front. And then I'll put my little uh, Frosty Flake box in the front. And this one I hold my bottles, my glue, my fiber tag, my uh, fray, my no fray. Uh, uh, you know, my aspirins, you know, stuff like that that I have on my desk okay and this one I'll hold my, my tiny pieces of paper you know like like for my ATCs and this one here will hold my little bottles like that because my my desk is a mess y'all my desk is a mess and it stays a mess and I only got so many jars and uh, things keep falling off the back of the desk and uh, bopping there in the, in the rear when she lays up against the wall and whatever falls under there I have to get my son to crawl under there and, and get it because I can't crawl under there and get it so I've decided that maybe I could just make me a little desk container storage unit and this is what I'm going for, y'all. And if these boxes don't work, I have lots more cardboard. I got these Coke cardboards. And I, I got mailer cardboards. And, and cereal boxes. And a popcorn box. And if none of these work, I, got, I still got a whole stack. So that's the plan, y'all, is to figure out something to put on my desk. To, to contain my little bits okay and so I painted me up a couple of papers I got this one and I got this scribbly one you know I really like the scribbly one I, that's weird you know I was just making little tornadoes you know and I think it came out pretty good except for right here that didn't come out too good but yeah I kind of like it. So, uh, I don't, I only made two because, you know, I couldn't be bothered to make more. Uh, well, at first I wasn't sure whether I liked them or not. But I, I like these okay. I like the bright, pretty colors. I don't like the blue, smudgy part. But I do like the, uh, the bright, pretty colors. So I'm going to make me a few more of these. And I'm going to do it right this time, y'all. I'm going to paper my boxes first. So I'm going to make me a few more of these. Different colors and maybe zigzaggies. So this is going to be a wild desk container. Yeah. Bright, beautiful colors to make me happy. Okay? So what I'm thinking I'm going to do is because I have a flying dog hair and smuck and whatever comes off of dogs and, and one of my dogs had that little doggy disease you know so I want to leave the the lid a flap 
to, to open and close. But I'm not sure how that's going to work exactly. Let's say you add a tab and put a little piece of Velcro on it. But, uh, yeah, that, that's my ideas. That's my thinkings. And uh, as soon as I get a couple of my painty papers painted, or maybe I'll make a, a just a cozy to go on top of it, like to sit overnight. And then when I want to use my containers to craft with, I'll take the cozy off. So that's an extra step I could do. I do have material I can hand sew. So, uh, yeah, I might do that. Yeah, so this is a thinking video of how I'm going to make a little container for my desk to contain all my little wayward items and maybe make more room on my desk. Or maybe my container will take up so much room. And now that I'm sitting here looking at it, I'm thinking, you know, while I'm at it, I could make an envelope box to keep my mail contained with one of these here boxes. So, yeah, that's an idea. Let's do that. So, I got plenty of these boxes, y'all. Don't worry. Plenty of them. That's it. That's the plan. So, I'm going to go paint me some painty papers. And, uh, letting y'all in on the plan. If y'all have any ideas before I get started, uh, you can let me know in the comments any tips or tricks uh, let me know because you know uh, I, everything is new and I've never done nothing like this and uh, I could use all the advice or help that I could get so I'm gonna uh, put these over to the side break out the old paint yay and uh, take me up some more painty papers and, and I'm going to paper them first. I learned my lesson the last time. Paper first. <laughs> okay, y'all. Thank you so much for uh, coming and visiting me. And uh, I sure do appreciate all the lovely, wonderful comments everybody has been uh, making here lately. My goodness. I, uh, it just makes me feel so good to have so many wonderful online friends. And uh, I, I do appreciate it. So, but yeah, there's that. Okay. So, I'm not, not going to keep you. No, I've got to get my box. And uh, this short little video to let you know what I'm thinking today. And uh, so, as always, do as the Lord leads you to do. And I will see you on my next video. Bye-bye now.